What's up guys, in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how you can get all your music from your iPod uh, or iPhone to your computer. This is good for you. This is good for you if you keep reformatting your computer, your computer breaks down. So if you want to back up something, like back up your music, photos, anything, you can do this with anything. What you got to do, what you need is a program called Disk 8 and you can go get that from um, just google up disk 8.com and it should um, it should bring you to this page and then you just hit download disk 8 so you PC hit save file, hit the run the installation file I already, got, I already installed it um, to make this process faster so um, go ahead and install that file for, uh, on your computer once you do that you're going to come to this um, it's going to put an icon on your um, desktop uh, with this uh, like this icon well what you gotta do is double click it and once you do that it's going to bring you up to this page and then it says looking for iPhone or iPod touch please plug it in down there so let's plug in our iPhone or iPod touch and then it's going to refresh the folder <coughs> Mine's already set up for this time, but when you open this, what you're gonna get is hold on just a second. Ah, uh, still refreshing. Okay, mine's already set up, but once you but when you do yours, it's gonna bring you up to this specific screen, this same exact screen. So what you gotta do is click on um, disk aid folder there's a drop down arrow right here click on it and navigate to the media folder and once you go there it's gonna give you all these options what you gotta do is go to iTunes underscore control double click it and uh, double click it it's gonna bring you up to this page and hit and then it's gonna say artwork iTunes and music double click music it's gonna bring you with uh, it's taking some time So once again guys, all you need for this is um, a iPod Touch obviously and a USB cable that comes with your iPod Touch. Uh, so that's all you need for this. Um, mine's not syncing at the moment, I don't know why. Uh, Alright, there you go. So navigate to your music page and it's going to bring you up with all these bunch of weird name files it's as f uh, files up to 49 mine goes up to 49 so what you got to do is click on music and click on copy to pc once you do that's going to bring you up to this folder and then on your desktop make a new folder name it music and then hit ok music right here don't click on this or you could click on this what you can do is select them all but I don't re recommend you doing that so what you do is go to music and then once it loads up right click on music and it says copy to PC copy to PC and click on music and ok and then it's going to say copying to PC please wait and you see folders and you can open up that folder it's going to bring you to the music folder and it's going to start and then it's just gonna show one one right now because it's still copying. So if you keep if I keep waiting for this, it will keep on adding new folders. So you can watch this process right now. And pull up this window too. So it's spell number five. It is a pretty slow process. I will stop the video for now, but once it's done, then I'm gonna come back and show you how you can use this, how you can put all these folders onto your iTunes. Uh, so I'll stop this video for now because it's nowhere even close to being done. So I'll come back when it's done. All right, I'll see you then. All right, so guys, I have left it in the same exact way. Uh, and let's see here 49 folders here and 49 folders here so it seems to be done so we'll go ahead and minimize out of this and open up itunes 
and when you open iTunes, um, you can't just open these random looking demented little folders, demented name folders, I will say. So <coughs> it did take four minutes to do all 49 files. So what you gotta do is go to file, on well, something, I think it's still loading or syncing my iPod. There you go. File and it's gonna say add a folder to library. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna select this all, select all of this and delete it. And, remove. and as you can see, it's all cleared out. So I'm gonna do add and folder to library. And I'm gonna go to my desktop or wherever I saved the folder. And I'm gonna find the music folder, music, and I'm gonna add. Um, press Control and press A, and it's gonna select all of these folders and hit select folder. It's gonna add it. <coughs> it's processing all these random files by name, so it should come up on your iTunes as your song folder. There you go. That's it. These are all the folders. These are all the songs that were in my iPod, and they are all uh, what you call. Mm -hmm. They do all have names besides one. I don't know why one name one. Uh, let's see this folder. Let's bump talks and harmony. <coughs> so all the files do have their names. Well, these are just uh, Linkin Park songs from reanimation. So. Yeah, they do all have their names. So, and it's also processing artwork. It also does artwork, and I do have movies in there too. So, um, <coughs> that's about it on how to get how to transfer music for free. Uh, subscribe my videos, rate my videos, comment, any requests, I'll take it, any app reviews that you want me to do before you buy it, I'll do that for you, and that's about it, see you next time guys.